All right, folks, the deck is Elemental OTK Shaman. The goal of the deck is to get cost reduction for our elementals in the early game, work our way towards Blaze Caller and Kalamos for some burst damage, uh, bounce them back to hand with either Grumble or Bog Slasher, and keep bursting down the opponent. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash ruffle. Watch this! Sir? Early ice fishing seems good. I just think the the fire plume isn't great into this hand anyway, so. Play a 3-3 three, three here. Well, that's going to force the Fogel Tox now, isn't it? Really wanted to get the Granite Forgeborn down to him. It's a good draw. Especially with the uh, bird in hand. Next turn I can go here and then here. And then here, and then here, and just continually freeze their stuff for a bit. Suddenly free shaman. More stats, more good. be a, a pretty easy win from here. We just bop him in the face and then repeat the uh, battle cry with the macaw. Dead. No. <laughs> one damage off legal and one mana off legal. If only I had that beautiful chat mana. Seems pretty unlikely this 1917 dies from here. It also seems very unlikely that we die from here. Ah, yes. Yes. That'll save you. Keep the Sleep Breaker. I don't think I want the Bog. Nor the, uh... Bloom. Ugh. I just need to get to the Snowfall Guardian. Oh, hey. Look at that. And especially with the Grumble, I can chain that pretty cleanly. Ooh, celebrate the holiday. Happy holiday! You can. Fly, Polly! Yeah. 
rather this be a sandstorm, but it's like a coin for most of my hand. That gets me this on five and then grumble snowfall again on six. In the box? Seems pretty good. Just need to find some macaws now. It's honestly not a bad draw. I don't know if I want to play the Snowfall next turn if I don't hit uh, Macaw or another Snowfall. I'm going to have to play the Snowfall. Ugh. Oh my god. Oh, that was so bad. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> uh, we did it, chat. No Rokara for you this game. No Hearthstone for you this game either, from here on out. See if I can get him to play the Rokara and not have space for the Juggernaut. So this is a bad play. But I do not care. Ow. <laughs> uh, the upshot of or upside of this is also that I like get to kill them too because of the damage going to face. Uh, and not quite. Never mind. I'm one off. There's no shelter from my fury. I could keep the opponent in this for a little bit longer, but no I am a top deck god. Is what I learned from this game. I haven't seen a warlock in a very long time. Uh, keep the dungeon here. It looks like the uh, pain lock, or whatever you want to call this deck, which means individual uh, freeze effects might be good. It also could be Mechathune, I suppose. Even cute luck. Okay. Looks like either Mechathune or Giants. Rumble is good to have. Go granite. And um, probably hold on to the Grumble. Room. Sure. 
kind of deletes their uh, raise Deadpool early. That is incredible to have. Just get this played so that we can draw two. Please kill this filthy dark glare. Um, there's no dark glare in their deck. Reason that now. Oh, you built this for me? Flames can shoot me. This is a 12 mana play that might be worth holding out for. Or they're just gonna die? Ew. <laughs> that's a card. Calimos does six, right? So that's twelve. If they tap here, they're dead. More bones to gnaw on. Yeah. Doesn't look like they're tapping this turn. But I can Flurgle Tox to get my one damage. Hmm. It's still probably worth the Flurgle Tox here anyway. Is it? Avalanche. Avalanche. Alright. That should set up a kill. Wait, what? <laughs> this battlefield will be mine. What lurks beyond the fire? Spam the board early. I don't think that the macaw is what I'm looking for. Snowfall is absolutely what I'm looking for, though. Now I want the macaw back. Ice Fishing is also a good card. I can play that next turn, and then go here and here, which will allow me to get more elementals in hand. In a box? Pirate stuff. Yeah, we just spam the board next turn, and uh, reduce the cost of the snowfall. Unless I feel the need to uh, floor gold talks, but I would rather hit a three drop. Ooh, now I kind of want a sandstorm. Maybe I do just floor gold talks this because this is kind of a lot of damage. So we know they have the anchor, right? And then now I just can easily bridge from Fly. 
or into the uh, snowfall turn. It's fine. Didn't need that to survive. Very good hit. Wasted two damage on it. Pretty much give up my next turn, but that's fine. I want to get better value off of the snowfall anyway, and like going wide into the board seems pretty good. Someone's gotta lead the, charge. the more I delay, the more burst I end up with because I can start working in hero powers as well. I kind of want to save that for the Snowfall. Next turn is Hero Power Snowfall. I can follow that with a Bog Slosher. No, I won't be able to. So many choices. Next turn is Snowfall Bog Slosher. A six. If I hero power, it gains. No, I'm just. I, I want to set up for the turn eight kill with the, uh, with the Calamos. One, two, three, four. So it's eight, eleven. Yeah, that won't get the me there alone. So. Buy an extra turn. Good weapon for them, but we're gonna board lock them next turn. We're gonna need more oh. oh, we're taking, taking at least four for the rest of this. That's still very bad, but some of it could get soaked up by the snowfall. So it's 11 plus 12, 22, or 23. Am I one off right now? Can double heal off of this. We clear the board instead, then they can... No, that would be a mistake. That's actually a very good hit for me some half the time. Because I would overload and I wouldn't be able to uh, double up the Calamos. So. I think maybe they should have just not swung there. You give me strength. What lurks beyond the firelight? Why was Curse Blade ever a weapon? It was played in the best deck in the format for a period of time. Uh, I think I have to keep the Sandy Boy just in case it's uh, Shadow Priest. It's a long animation. The day I learned, yeah, Curse Blade was in the when Fiery War Axe got nerfed was in the optimal builds of uh, Pirate Warrior for a while because two damage face is better than some of their alternatives. I gotta play this 
uh, because I'm going to need to Flurgle Tox next turn or I die. Means they're probably not developing and just hero powering to maximize damage. But I've got healing ran, so I can recover. May not be possible for them to get a kill on this Flurgle, so still do some work here. Probably don't want to play the Sandstorm Elemental unless the clear is UC. It's because that prevents me from playing the Snowfall. <laughs> clear is looking pretty UC. It's like, why did the Flurgle give up on that attack? What's going on? And then... Alright, none of these are keeps. Snowfall should be helpful. You can coin a Granite Forgeborn, which is nearly like coining every card in my deck. Seems alright. Not even Warlock. That's a good turn, too. Because it could be Giants. You had a free trade on this, but I'm not really concerned about minion damage right now. There's no way that's worth, right? Yeah. Gotta take a moment after <laughs> uh, after that. I don't want to freeze anything other than a giant. Or a knoll, I guess, would be fine too. More bones to gnaw on. Knoll dies. Grumble. Honestly, that makes me hesitant to hero power. I kind of didn't want to play even the uh, Sandstorm, but... Just because the overload makes things awkward. But this is... Always going to restart the elemental chain anyway. You are defenders of a Very good draw. Nature waits for no one but me. Also a good draw. I assume that means they have uh, fleshies on hand. Yep. I can get these back with the grumble if I want. Then I give up the grumble, so I doubt that's worth. I'd rather just get the snowfall back. I 
is a broom turn is uh, kind of inevitable at this point, so the Flurgle's probably not long for this world. This is awkward. So many choices. I feel like the Snowfall is way too valuable to just give away, even with a parrot in hand. Thirteen total mana. Eleven. Thirteen. Fourteen total mana would have been required of me. But I do have a kill on ten mana with the blaze caller. I can hero power, send it face, lightning bloom, lightning bloom, grumble, and play it again. It's assuming this somehow gets cleared. A lot of bursts they're giving up here. If I freeze, I lose the game because it cannot be frozen. And if I play for lethal, I win the game because it's lethal. Like getting to the snowfall is just everything this deck wants to do. Dunganir is also good. Wait, I can start freezing as early as next turn and just go here and then here. But that's probably a little bit too hasty. Getting the bird is very good, though. I, I was going to say I might have to freeze the board if they uh, hit a captain, though. So they hit the captain. Hmm. Trades make this a little bit less urgent. And I don't really have good follow-ups if I just coin out the uh, Snowfall because a single Makah isn't going to get me there from here.
a lot of stats. Oh my god, what a draw. Can you explain why there's no shutter in the deck? Uh, it doesn't fit in the deck with what we're trying to do. We want to kill the opponent before Shutter Walk would come down. <laughs> and the <laughs> oh my god. And the attack lands there, because of course it does. Thank you to legendary patrons Brian Wynn, Fizzle Jizzix, Gion Rusi, Battlefly, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Horback, Noggleshire, Nate Drex, Saint Arthur, Shadow1TV, Sognisman, and Fanfix.